they have low self-esteem in themselves. That is just the truth. They might not say it. They might not own up to it. And then we should always make sure that, you know, Pastor John made something, he, he mentioned something. He said that victory is of the mind. For you to declare yourself victorious, it has to be from your mind. And if you look at Mordecai, he was someone who had already made up his mind. He knew what he wanted and he, he stood by it. He never faltered, he never changed, he never slapped behind. And that was the reason why God exposed Haman and rewarded Haman with the same plan, with the same trap that he wanted to set for Mordecai. We have a lot of Mordecais today who people who people like Haman are rising up against. We have a lot of people who are rising up against you in your places of work, at home, in your, in your father's house, in your mother's house. But I want you to know today that if you put on the life of the Spirit as Mordecai did, if you make up your mind, if you decide in your mind that no evil can come to you, if you decide in your mind that God is really going to come and defend you, I am telling you today that the trap that those enemies have set for you will go back to them. Amen. They will fall into it. Amen. I want you to know that for every commitment, for every dedication, for every sweat that you invest in the house of the Lord, there is a reward. There is a reward. The reward might not be something that is visible. 